Gentlemen, today we're gonna be taking advantage of some summer fishing and we're gonna be doing something kind of interesting. First, we're gonna be using some old technology and some new technology. It's a map, it's a map. Now check this out, but I think we're gonna be heading right here. Check it out. We got specs and reds all year. And later on, we're gonna be getting into that new technology, but for now, we need to get out there. Check this out, this is freaking gorgeous. This is amazing, I'm not even kidding, this is freaking amazing. Check out the surf, it's just laid down, I don't know, I just wanna start fishing, but the plan is, dude, I have identified two spots. First spot, in here shallow, and then later we're gonna move out to the end of the jetties and see if we can find some bigger fish, but let's just get in there right now. You know, we gotta start off with the beautiful, beautiful top water. Can't tell the water clarity yet, but just judging by everything else, this looks like insane conditions. It's gonna be crazy, I think. I think we're gonna catch some fish, maybe. Oh, there's an instant blow up, giant blow up on the top water. Might be able to catch more fish using a different lure than top water, but you're not gonna have more fun. Holy cow! You think those baits were getting chased or what? There he is, oh man, he dropped it. No, he still had it, they're all on it, dude. Oh, there he is, we got him. Yeah, freaking sick, dude. This feels like a decent trout, too. Wow, he's shaking like crazy. <laughs> dude, there's a ton of bait, and they're all getting scared. This is a good trout, I think. Good way to start the day. Woo, let's go, baby. Speckler. All right, man, check it out. Nice speckler to start off the morning right there. On what else but the top water to start off the morning? Now for the technology we're gonna be using, it's very important to get a picture. So let's get a few good pictures in here. All right, we'll let this little guy go back right into the surf. Woo -hoo. All right, man, it's going good so far to find this spot. And we took those pictures for a reason. Let's check out that technology right here. I have teamed up with Fishbrain for this video and Fishbrain is a mobile app all about fishing. On Fishbrain you can connect with other fishermen, make new fishing buddies, and you can even check out interactive maps where you can find new fishing spots. And then something really cool is the app can actually detect a fish species just from a picture of the fish. On top of that, there are some paid premium features where you can see exactly on the map where fish are being caught and also some fishing forecasts that suggest some good spots to fish. Now, like I said, one of the coolest things about this app is you can go right into the interactive map and see what's being caught and where. Like right here, you can see redfish, speckled trout, black drum. Oh look, there's me. We got some different stuff being caught and you can kind of see if you want to go there at the time being and see what's being caught there at the moment. And if you wanted to, you can also even sort the catches by the different months and different species. If you just want to see speckled trout and redfish, you can do that. And even better, if you have the premium, you can enable exact catch positions. And then you can just click on these little things and see exactly where fish are being caught. And now one of the craziest things that this app can do is when you're logging a catch, you just put in your photo of the fish and it will automatically detect what it thinks the fish is. And usually it gets it right. It's pretty crazy. Trust me, if you're a fisherman, you're gonna like this app. Check out Fish Brain in the description of this video and make sure to follow me. I'm gonna be posting some fish on there. But right now we need to get back to the jetty real quick. We gotta switch it up, it's all plastic. We got the down south lure. We got the down south lure locked and loaded and ready to throw. Come on down south. Take me down south where the trout are. There he is. That's a nice one, I think. Don't drop him, dude. That's a nice speckler. Let's go, dude, in the surf. Oh my God, so sick. I love it. Pretty, pretty decent one. Man, he's a solid looking trout right there. Oh. Mm. 
Woohoo! That's a nice little fish. Nice, dude. Surf trout right there. Thick boy. You can just feel holding this fish. He's a lot. He's a lot stouter than your average trout. Hey, check it out. Trout number two on the down south. Is there anything better than this? All right, so we shall we keep throwing the down south? It's working good so far. I don't know, man. Fishing out here, you never, you just never know. There's so many more possibilities than fishing inshore. A lot crazier stuff can happen, and that gets you hyped up. Wow, on the fall, dude. There's a better guy, maybe. God dang, dude! I didn't even have to do nothing. Just throw it out there, and then a fish ends up on the on the line. He's riding the wave, he's surfing. That's a better guy. Nice. Dang, you took my lure. You can't have it, brother. All right, see you, bud. Be with your people. Bye. Keep on coming, all right man that was a good phase one to our fishing so far now we're gonna hit up spot number two we're gonna be looking for some big old redfish and whatever other kind of big fish there is and you know we got to start off with a big three ounce spoon dropping it in deep all right, let's have a look at the top of the world. Ugh. Dang, dude, the water looks good. Not bad. Should we just go in, stupid, in the stupid area? Oh, there we go, you got it, dude. There is that big fish we were looking for. That did not take long. Was loose. We need to move down. If we pop off, we're gonna be in trouble, buddy. Oh! Now nah, he dropped it. <laughs> oh man! Woo! That's what I'm talking about. I told you we're going for big guys. <laughs> we're going for the big guys. All right. Well, that Jack defeated us really quick. So now we're going for the main target redfish and I'm gonna be fishing my super secret redfish hole I'm not telling you where this one is but we're going deep that's all I'm gonna say oh what was that oh tarpon wow I didn't know this is the tarpon spot we'll get him on the spoon don't worry I'm sure they'll eat it Tarpon are pretty easy to catch. They'll hit anything. Oh, that's tarpon, dude. Wow, the tarpon are rolling like crazy. I'd like to throw a realistic swim bait at them, but there's no way I could reach that far with a swim bait. They're too far out. Surely this right here is the best way to use this app. I'm sure nothing can ever go wrong. You have the information at your fingertips at all times. <laughs> Should I try casting with it? This is gonna go bad and I'm gonna lose my phone. Guaranteed. Oh no, this is dumb. That's the best I can do. <laughs> what do you guys think about that guy? Pretty realistic, I think. Who knows what the hell's out here, dude? There's been giant sharks. There's been tarpon. Could be kingfish, possibly. Giant redfish. Big old jacks. And a ton of trout. This actually casts pretty freaking far. Maybe not far enough, but pretty freaking far. Oh, look, dude, we got a freaking bite! Something bit it! Oh my god, I was not expecting that. <laughs> god dang, dude. I only made like 20 casts so far. That sounds kind of like a lot, but tarpon fishing, you gotta be freaking patient, man. I'm trying to learn to be more patient with these guys. Oh, that was a big freaking trout! Did it just attack these mullet, dude? Wow! 
just goes to show even out here in deeper water there's still trout sometimes out here too there's the big trout are those freaking giant trout dude those are giant trout swimming with mullet that does not make sense is this do you guys know is this something that happens is this supposed to happen you would think the mullet would be scared of them I think there's a bunch of tiny little redfish in here. If we catch them, they're going on the fish brain. There's one. There he is. Uh, yeah, baby. That's what I'm talking about. So the giant fish at the end defeated us. So we came in shallow for some more giant bull redfish. That's actually bigger than I thought they were going to be. <laughs> There's something right there. Is that a red? Yeah, it's, it's a shark. shark. It's a shark right Sheeper, sheeper. Shark! <laughs> we freaking caught one of these sharks. I just saw one too. God dang it, on a freaking gulp. Ooh. Well, apparently there's a lot of these little sharks running, running through the surf. This guy just happened to eat the freaking gulp. How about that? <laughs> these mullet are not going to be happy about me releasing this shark. Let's see you, little guy. Well, you went the wrong way, brother. Not what I expected to catch right now, but I'll take it, dude. That's interesting. I probably should have checked what kind of shark that was. Whoops. All right, man, we are back. We are back on the freaking mainland. That was a pretty crazy day fishing, man. Man, we got some trout in the morning at the first spot. Then we moved over to the second spot, hooked up on a big old jack. I wish we could have landed that guy, but he, he got the better of us. Hey, thank you guys so much for joining me on this fishing trip. I love you guys very much. Be safe. We'll see you on the next fishing trip. Breathe.